All right. Hey, you're listening to Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene. I'm Bree Morgan. And I'm Kyle Roberts. And his mic is really loud. Oh, yeah, it is. There we go. And uh, today we have Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbeck with us. They are from Tomo, Wisconsin. How are you guys doing today? Good. How are you? Pretty good. It a, it's always a rough morning. It's only, it's it's not even that late. And it's, no, it's not. Ugh. Alrighty, so Kyle, how about you uh, take the show for a little bit today? How about I take the show? Yeah. Well, we have J squared here. I mean, Jaden, other Jaden. Uh, how should we uh, work this out? I mean, we have J Jaden one, Jaden two. That works. <laughs> yeah, that works. Yeah. So uh, Jaden one, how about you tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, my name is Jaden. Um, I'm a freshman in high school. I um I started playing guitar around seventh grade, I think. And um, I've really been into music ever since I was just a little kid, and I've been singing since I was a little kid. But um, I really started getting serious about it around the time middle school started. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. Uh, J2? Um, well, I'm a senior in high school, and I started music in middle school when I joined the middle school show choir. And when I was little, I actually was a terrible singer. <laughs> and my mom, like, joked around, was like, oh, you're going to be a great singer when you grow up. And now I'm pretty decent, so. Pretty. so thanks, Mom, for pushing yeah. that dream, huh? <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> One of these days I'll get Kyle to talk a little more. So, like I said, we have uh, Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbeck. Um, Jaden is a first, Jaden one, is that what we're going by? Mm-hmm. Jaden one is a freshman mm-hmm. in high school. Yep. That's fun. I remember being a freshman in high school. Yeah, 30 years ago. <clears throat> oh, thanks, Kyle. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm not that old. Yep. And then Jaden uh, Storbeck is a senior in high school. So that's pretty exciting yeah. yeah are you uh are you planning on going to college or? yeah uh, i've applied at uh minnesota madison and harvard so harvard people harvard oh, yeah. i it's going places musicians are some of the smartest people believe it or not that's generous <laughs> yeah. that's really generous Chris. so um why don't you guys tell us i guess let's start with um what are some of your influences like when it comes to let's start with your influences for songwriting how about that well my um Influence is really pretty much um everything that I would go through in my daily life. I can take and put it into a song, or if something big happens in my life or something sad, then I can I can take that and anybody can really take that and make a beautiful song out of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I get you. I well, like I said, I I don't. <laughs> yeah, you write... some life experiences I can write about, and some most aren't... of it's just burning down people's houses. <laughs> 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 I don't have, like, a arson fetish or anything. I just, I don't know. I guess I might have, like, I have a loving boyfriend of six years. Love him to death. Um, but I think I might have, like, a small, small, like, hatred of men or something. Because I like to oh. Oh. write songs about burning down their houses and stuff. I don't know. It's so, weird. So I just we should can't, leave. I can't write pretty <laughs> things. I don't know. <laughs> um, how about, do you write any songs, um, Jaden Starbuck? I don't really write songs. I uh, just do. Um, actually, one of my friends, Jerry Fushianis, she writes songs, and I just kind of edit them and then put it to music, kind of. That's so. cool. So yeah. you do computer work? Uh, not so much computer, but mostly just messing around on piano or ukulele. Okay. Um, okay. Just yeah. coming up with chords to go with it, and that's that's cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, cool. Um, so Jaden, one, you played at Cranfest. Yeah. Right. Yep. I saw you. Um. I mean, what did you think of that? We played there. We thought it was pretty fun. Yeah. yeah. It was um it was a lot of fun and um it's really exciting after you get done with the song and then you see all your friends in front of you just cheering mm-hmm. so loudly. It's the best feeling in the world. Would you say um a lot of your friends and stuff are pretty big supporters of you? Oh yeah. <coughs> yeah. Definitely. That's cool. How about your um how about your parents? Oh, my parents are probably my um my biggest fans in the world. That's really. good. They've never missed one of my shows. For the record, his parents are in the studio yeah. with us, so he probably had to say that. But <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Jaden's parents, why don't you come over to the mic and uh, tell us a little about um, what it's like having a son so involved in music? We have um, coming on the mic now is Jaden's dad. His name is Roger Jones. He is actually a part of the Troublemakers with Scott Wilcox and Scott Tattoo, and he also has another band called. 
Nuck and Futs. <laughs> And they do a lot of everything. Pretty much the same with um, Scott Wilcox, too, right? The Troublemakers, you do a lot of everything. Yeah, everything. Country to rock, blues, reggae, everything. Okay, so um, <clears throat> it's kind of cool that you came along because you're um, pretty big in the music, too, then I take it, right? All you my got life, the two yeah. bands. Yeah. Um, so I guess, what am I trying to say here? You really, you really push, do you really push your son, or no, do you kind of just let him? him I let him. I let him take his own path mostly. I help him out along the way. I, I help. I ta- taught him guitar, and he took it from mm-hmm. there. And he's a better guitarist than I am now. <laughs> <laughs> and okay. He's just. He's very talented, and I'm. I can't be more proud of anybody. He's. He's awesome. Aww. That's awesome. I love you, Dad. <laughs> Aw, that's so sweet. All right, and then we have Scott's mom over here, Sarah. She doesn't look like she wants to talk on the microphone, so that's fine. I'll just tell you a little bit about her. She definitely, I don't know if she seems like a stage mom, but um, I actually got a hold of Jaden through Sarah. And it was kind of funny because I got a hold of my aunt, who was on our last show, director of Plaid Mm -hmm. Tidings. And she, like, threw me in a group chat with all these moms (laughs) (laughs) that have these musical kids and stuff. So that was kind of fun. So that's how I got a hold of... um, Jaden won. So, yep. yeah, I mean, what do you think, Kyle? Uh, yeah, she doesn't look very excited. <laughs> <laughs> uh, She's taking pictures for us, though. Oh, that's good. So, um, no, she, I mean, as any mom would be, she's probably really, 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 really proud. Right? I know my mom's proud of me. Um, she's a really good support system, as I'm sure you are to Jaden. Oh, one. yeah, she is. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so, Jaden, why don't you tell us a little bit about, um, what am I? I can't think today. Uh oh. What do you think? Your blonde's showing. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's always showing. <laughs> so, how did you guys start um, playing together? Well, we met when I was in the my seventh grade year in the middle middle school musical for um it was Fame. I was Tyrone Jackson, and that's pretty much how we met. And then we just kind of clicked from there. Okay. Mm-hmm. You guys, um, have you done a lot of musicals? Yeah, I've been in um, musicals since I was in sixth grade. Okay, what all, what uh, musicals have y'all been in? Well, my first one ever was Willy Wonka. Okay. I, uh, was, I was Mike TV. And then I was in the ACT production of The Sound of Music, oh, where I played cool. Kurt Von Trapp. And then my seventh grade year, I, I was in fame, I was Mike TV. And then my eighth grade year was The Wizard of Oz, and I played the Scarecrow. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. Cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you did play the Scarecrow, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, I remember you in Willy Wonka too. That was a good show. Mm. All right, was, Kyle, take fun. it away. Kyle, take it. Okay, J One. What's your favorite artist, band, or artist? My favorite band artist, probably Scotty and the Troublemakers. <laughs> 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 they are pretty good. Yeah, they, they are. are very they good, are. and they play mm-hmm. all different types of music, and it's just it's great. <clears throat> what about you, Jaden Two? If I were to pick one, I'd probably pick Tenacious D. Tenacious D. Because <laughs> the songs are just like, <laughs> even though like their lyrics and stuff are super like funny and stuff, the music behind They're it is actually just great. Really, just... Kyle does a great job on the guitar. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and Jack Black's just an awesome guy all yeah. around. <laughs> I thought it was uh, funny when I saw um because I I had previously only known Jack Black from Tenacious D and I saw him on a a kids show Yo Gabba Gabba and I thought. That was just... <laughs> I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you've ever heard Tenacious D, it's like total polar opposite of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, so we are going to take a short break. We are Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene. All right, we're back, and you're listening to Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene. If you're just tuning in with us, we have Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbuck here. From also known as J1 and J2. J1 and J2. <laughs> It was really funny when um, when they got here, Jaden Storbuck, who was actually, um, I kind of knew you were coming along because you're playing the cajon for his right. original yes. today, right? Yeah, so he like gets out of the car and I'm like, oh, he's like, I'm Jaden. And I'm like, oh, hi, Jaden. And I like thought it was <laughs> the Jaden that's singing and writing <laughs> the songs. And then the other one's like, oh, hi, I'm Jaden. And I'm like, this, <laughs> what? I'm Welcome like, <laughs> to the Twilight Zone. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is this? So, um... Before we went on break, we were talking about... What were we talking Oh, um, favorite artists. Yeah, your favorite artists. So, like, what's kind of, like, your go-to... Like, if you were to, like, go to your iPod right now, mm-hmm. what would you, like, go to? Like, right now? Hmm. Hmm. Well, right now I've gone... Th- I'm kind of in a dubstep phase, so I listen to a lot of stuff like that and listening to, like, all the different layers. And I, mm-hmm. it'd be really cool to 
do something kind of like that, make a little yeah. song mm-hmm. with all the different layers working together. To yeah, layering is real fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you sound like you really like to um, kind of edit and put things together and whatnot. Do you think that's something you would maybe – I know you said like Harvard and stuff. Do they do, they do that stuff at Harvard? Mm-hmm. I'm not sure. I haven't really looked into it. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, I'll apply. Maybe I'll what get it. What are you um, <laughs> looking to go to school for? Um, well, right now, what I've decided on is chemistry because I took uh, chemistry classes last year and the year before, and I absolutely love them. But now I'm kind of looking back at my high school career, and I've done a lot of stuff in the performing arts. Mm-hmm. So I think I might do something with theater. <clears throat> from yeah. from one performer to another. I went to the, a year of college for theater. Mm-hmm. It was a great school. I went to UWL. It was a great program, great people, all mm-hmm. that stuff. But definitely, like, if you're going to really pursue a performing arts, I highly recommend go- recommend going to, like, an actual performing arts yeah. college. Like, uh, yeah. that's what they do. That's mm-hmm. all they do. Everyone around you, that's all they do. It's just really good to just immerse yourself in that. Because yeah. it was great when I was, like, in the theater department or, like, down in, like, all the choral rooms and stuff like that, being around everybody made me, like, really get me into it and stuff like that. But then I went back to my dorm, and bless her heart, my roommate, Emma, I was so lucky. It was a random roommate, and she turned out to be, like, my best friend. Um, But she was, like, something with, um, like, therapeutic rec or something like that. So it Mm -hmm. was, like, there was really nobody. I'd, like, talk about music and stuff. And she's, like, yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. This is great. And Mm -hmm. then she'd talk about her stuff, and I'm, like, yeah, that <laughs> sounds boring. <laughs> so definitely recommend like mm-hmm. going to an actual performing arts yeah, college. I've, I've gotten emails from performing arts colleges, so I'm thinking about applying there. Maybe. They are freaking expensive, oh, but yeah. they are yeah. worth it. Oh, yeah. I have a girlfriend who actually goes to Berkeley in Boston. Really? Oh, and okay. she she loves it. I mean, it's mm-hmm. amazing there, but she's it's like over 60 grand a year to go. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. Mm-hmm. So how about uh, so I know Jaden Jones, Jaden won. I know you're just a freshman, but what kind of, I mean, do you have, like, an outlook of where you're going to well, go? Or? Um, I was thinking of just applying for colleges, like, in Wisconsin, so I'd be close to home. Mm-hmm. So I was thinking I'd just apply for UW, Milwaukee, Madison, and La Crosse, and maybe going to a dance school. Um, he was thinking about going to a dance school in either New York or Los Angeles. Do so you guys like to dance? Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, that's cool. That's awesome. It was really, um, I had a, we had a couple of. Um, male dancers on my dance team in high school and it actually it made it 10 times better it was fun we could do like flips and stuff because mm-hmm. we had muscles to throw us right. around a, and a couple of uh male dancers at our shows too okay you got to be Every careful so when you say male dancers no no Kyle. i know <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you get, the, get the wrong impression oh with yeah that no one well, you get what i'm saying <laughs> but so um Jaden, <laughs> Jaden one what about you like if you were to like pick up your ipod right now what would you go to well I just kind of got out of an 80s rock phase. Okay. But now now I listen to a lot of, like, acapella music. Like, um, yeah. those, like, five people. Are you a Pitch Pina. Perfect fan? I am. It's oh, okay. yes, I'm it's okay. Fan. Please don't look ashamed. It's, we can all be no. Pitch Perfect fans. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, Aka, excuse me? No. <laughs> <laughs> I could believe it. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I, um, I listen to a lot of, like, voice play and um, pentatonics, definitely. Yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. they're awesome. Oh, mm-hmm. definitely. Oh, man. They're super cool. A lot of home free too. Mm-hmm. They're they're kind of like yep. a country. Yep. Yeah. Group. Yep. Yeah. Um, they were on the holiday train last year. They were. Oh, really? yeah, yeah. So that was really cool. Yeah. I thought they're awesome. It's really. Mm-hmm. I'm a huge country fan. So to see like an acapella country group was kind of. Mm-hmm. It's really out of the norm. You know what I right. mean? So. Yeah, that's super cool. Um, what else have we asked them yet? I like can't. I really can't function today. What's your favorite color? Blue. Blue. Um, periwinkle. Perry, periwinkle. Yes. Wow, you seem like an out of the box kind of guy. So that's <laughs> yes. I like periwinkle. It's a cool Perry color. It's a good cool color. color. Um, so let's. Why don't you tell us a little bit? So on our third segment, when we come back from break in a couple minutes, we are going to actually hear a live original from Jaden. Do you want to kind of tell us a little bit about writing the original that you're gonna? Well, I I did get a lot of um help with just kind of what I wanted it to be about. But um, when I really sat down, it probably took me about half an hour to write. Okay. But um, and then we just kind of touched it up. Yeah. But my my um, my big inspiration for writing that song was probably I got turned down for homecoming for a homecoming date. 
But uh, it's whatever. I had fun anyway. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm over here with like a sad face, and he's like, "It's cool." It's cool. <laughs> it's all good. Like brush the ice off my shoulder. It's fine. <laughs> That's what really set it off. What, what really um got me writing. That's Heartbreak will do that. Oh yeah. yeah. If you ever need help writing songs about burning people's houses down, <laughs> you just call me up. I'll I'll help you with that one. <laughs> Um, okay, so we are going to take another short break, and when we come back, we will have a live original from Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbeck on the Cajon. Yep. You're listening to Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene. All righty, all righty, welcome back. You are listening to Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene. <laughs> <laughs> we just set up for the live original, and I realized Kyle doesn't have a microphone anymore. <laughs> 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 It's I'm funny. back. Okay, there we go. <laughs> All right, that was funny. All righty, so we have Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbuck from Toma. Wow, stutter, stutter. From Toma, and they are going to perform a live original for us, and it is called When. Whenever you're ready. Where do you go when you don't have a home? And how do you live when you're living alone? And all of this time I felt all on my own Then I never thought I'd get the chance to glow I've been beaten and bruised and I've been stabbed in the back Oh, so many times that I've stopped keeping track All of these years I felt so trapped And all that I want is what we used to have We used to be so close been all that I want to know We used to laugh and sing all day Oh, when did that all go away? We used to love and share and dance Just like a childhood romance When did that all go away? When did that all go away? Okay, you want to grab 
Do you still uh, want no, that one? Is, that'll work. That's purple. It's okay. That was one. that was really good. That was really good. That's awesome. You guys, Jaden's parents must be really really proud. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, that's, I think Kyle's proud. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I love the the J squared experience. The yeah. J squared. That's actually yeah, think about that. Think about there it. It's go. a good name. We're thinking. We'd like some <laughs> copyrights though, because Kyle did think of it. So I mean, no, you know, royalty was it not royalties? Well, how percent of the cut? No. Nah. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was that was awesome. Guys. You know, I was thinking while you were writing, um, I didn't start, or while you were singing, oi, um, I didn't start writing and playing guitar till, um, after my senior year of high school. So I just think it's really cool that you guys are already doing it. Like you're so into it, and you're already doing it. And I think getting started young. And it obviously helps a ton that your dad is a musician and your mom really mm-hmm. supports you. Oh, yeah. That, I mean, that always helps a lot when it comes to your music and stuff. But I think it's just like, just be thankful. You're really lucky that you have people that support you and do that because to get started early and to, I mean, that's a really good song. Yeah, that was, that was great. a really good song. So, yeah, okay. Totally radio worthy. We got a couple Ooh. more minutes left of the show here, Kyle. Do you got any fun questions for uh, him? Anything we haven't well, asked him yet? If you could have, wait. You have one superpower in, in the world, and it cannot be to have all of the superpowers. Okay. Um, I'd probably want to fly. That'd be really cool. Fly. Just fly everywhere. To freeze time. To freeze time, like uh, what's that movie? Click. Yeah. 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 Just to be able to stop time. Oh, and I almost forgot. Um, I want to give a shout out to my choir teacher, Mr. Witz, and Nathan Kale, my best friend, <laughs> for their musical input on the song. Okay. That's cool. So your choir teacher helped you a little bit mm-hmm. with a song. That's cool. I had a really uh, influential choir teacher too when I was growing up. It's it's pretty cool. Pretty it's cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay. Oh, what do you always ask them if you could have? Don't do the album. Just yeah. what's your like least? If you were stuck on an island, and what is it? You had to, you could have your least favorite song on repeat. My least favorite. Song? Yeah, let's do that. That's good because yeah. I'm repeat least like ten times song. worse than just being stuck yeah. with it. <laughs> Your but least then, favorite song. Why don't we song? just say? Why don't we just say? What's your least favorite song? Oh, on repeat's more fun. D- I don't, oh, oh man. Um, huh. uh, I don't know. I listen to a lot of things. Um, <laughs> probably um, something made by like Theory of a Dead Man or something like that. <gasps> what? Maybe. What? We're not friends. <laughs> We're not friends. I don't it know, can't but be. like, I don't like. Uh, or, no, maybe. No, it's okay. You cannot like them. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, oh, what does the fox yeah, say? Yeah, that was on reality. Oh my was... lord! Uh uh-uh. uh. Gag oh. with a pitchfork. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> with a pitchfork. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a little. That's a little with violent. With a pitchfork. We could write songs together. No. <laughs> <laughs> Good man. How about you, uh, Jaden? Too. What about you? Um probably be something like what does the fox say or one of those like big youtube hits that uh, like, like they're J-Beeps. good to listen to every oh, once in a while but I was, like if it was on repeat yeah. it'd be like okay i was just on youtube i was looking up a couple of things yesterday and i just happened to see like a new justin bieber like music video or whatever mm-hmm. i'm like oh, i'll watch it it looks like the music video looked kind of cool or whatever i i can't i can't do it i like watched like 30 seconds of it and i was like He's not even doing any, and he's a terrible dancer. Oh, yeah. I'm like, would oh, you? If you're not going to sing good, could you at least dance good in your music videos? <laughs> like one or the other here, bud. And then I'm like looking at all these other like pop artists, and like that's their thing. It's cool. Everybody's got their own niche when it comes to music and stuff. But the music videos don't make any sense. Mm-hmm. I'm like really confused when I'm watching, and I'm like, what are you singing about? I it can't. It doesn't correlate. I can't handle it. <laughs> But, okay, we are getting whoa, to the... Whoa, whoa. Oh, wait, wait, wait a second. One more thing. What would you pick? For my least favorite? Yes. Yeah. Anything screamo. Um, <laughs> yeah. Couldn't oh, yeah. handle it. <laughs> Can't. Couldn't. I mean, like I said, everybody's got their own niche and stuff when it comes mm-hmm. to music. Like, what you like is super cool, but I couldn't handle it. Mm-hmm. Like, what does the fox say? Like, who thought of that? What? Who Who made that song and was like, uh, this is a really good idea? I don't know, but I don't like him very much. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good idea when it first came out, but like yeah, the after. thirty seconds I heard of it, and yeah. then I'm then I'm over it. All right, so we are getting to the end of our show here. Kyle, do you want to take us away this time? Take me away. Take oh, Kyle gone. <laughs> we have Jaden Jones and Jaden Storbuck here with us, a freshman and senior from Toma High School. 
Um, we also have we also had their dad on the show for a little bit, Roger Jones. We're hopefully going to get him on with his bands now that I, I I've got him in my sights now. So now he's going to be on the show You're too. You're stuck, bud. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, um, we have everything will be on WRJC on our website. We, we post are, everything. We, we are on WRJC. I meant the website. Oh yeah. Oh. I think the links are going to be on there. If not, you can find them on www.localfrequencies.com. We also it's two three W's, two. Kyle. Three W's, and then we it's also have, <laughs> and then we also have a Facebook page, local frequencies. Do you guys have like a Facebook page or anything, like a, like an artist page? No? no, no. Do that. But if you want to friend request them, you can try. I don't know if they'll accept it, but you know, hey, it's worth a shot. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Do you post videos and stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So yeah, you want to find Jaden and post videos? We'll tag him and everything. Post some of his stuff on our. Facebook page, don't forget. Um, Kyle and I also have Facebook pages that we post everything. Anything else you want to add, Kyle? Um, not much. No? All Kyle right. Kyle out. Kyle out. <laughs> Bree out. You are listening to Local Frequencies, your connection to the local music scene.